what's up, Gun Nuts? It's Ferrari Steve, and today I'm going to do a product review on the Tipman X7 Action Handle. Look at that. Now, this is a cheap piece. It's $11. It's made out of plastic, and uh, so you shouldn't expect more than $11 out of it. But I think it's a good value for $11, and uh, I'm going to demonstrate why today. But before we go any further, let's do a uh, safety check on this uh, Smith & Wesson MP1522. Check the magazine, lock the bolt back, do a visual and manual inspection, and we're clear. All right, now obviously for 11 bucks you might not expect much, uh, and this MMP15 is actually something that my 13 year old daughter likes to shoot, and so I got this for her just to kind of help her work with a foregrip, and it attaches just as you would expect, unscrews here. And the screws are metal, but everything else seems to be just plastic, which is fine. Makes it lightweight. And reading some of the other Amazon reviews on it, it again, if you want a Daniel Defense or you want some um, high-end foregrip, this is probably not for you. But, you know, it fits right in place like you'd expect it would. And, you know, we'll fit it to where my daughter likes it later. But let's, let's say it's here. And it just screws into place, as you'd expect. So you can use it as a standard foregrip, right? And just hold on to it. Or if you've got it up in a firing position and you hit your thumb, you deploy a little bipod. And there it is, standing up in that bipod formation. Now again, for 11 bucks, don't expect anything crazy, but for what it does and how secure it feels and uh, how easy it is to both deploy and to, you know, you don't even need to press the button to pop these back in. I would imagine that you can squeeze them together and just drop it down, and there you go. And you're back to a standard foregrip, and you're back to bipod. It's, um, again, for an M something, you know, if it's an MP 1522, which has a lot of plastic on it already, I don't think you're going to complain about putting a plastic foregrip on. But even if you've got a really nice high-end uh, AR, I don't think you'll complain about putting this plastic foregrip on it, especially for the money. It may just be, you know, for 11 bucks, it might just be worth trying out and seeing if it works. And if it doesn't, you're 11 bucks out. You put it on your parts bin and you've got it available for something like this, for, um, you know, a little Trainer 22 AR. I think it's just perfect. So, again, that's the Tipman X7. You can get it for 11 bucks on Amazon, including shipping. And, um, you know, for the price, I kind of think it's hard to beat. This is Ferrari Steve reminding you that a happy gun is a used gun. This one's not used. It's, uh, it's pretty brand new, but I'm sure my daughter's going to fix that. Uh, get out there, practice, use your guns, because the first time you have to pull this trigger, you don't want it to be the first time you have pulled that trigger. Stay safe out there.